measures. Summertime always brings out motorcycles, but this summer the number of motorcyclists dying in crashes are alarming. The St. Clairsville and the Wintersville posts of the Ohio State Highway Patrol have each covered two fatal motorcycle accidents just since June. DK Wright is now live in the 7 Newsroom with a look at what's going on. DK. They're happening on state roads and back roads. They're mostly on weekends. There have been 113 motorcycle crashes this year in the 12 counties that make up the Highway Patrol's Cambridge District. 11 of those were fatal. And officials say some of those could have been preventable. Ride sober and wear the proper safety equipment, uh, including a helmet. In both of the fatal crashes that we had, neither driver was wearing a, a helmet. One of our motorcycle crashes, the most recent one, we suspect alcohol to be involved. In all the fatal crashes that we've had or investigated this year, you know, more than half, 66% of those crashes have involved an impaired driver. In the state of Ohio, fatal crashes are up this year 16%. Lieutenant Waddell says we are in the height of what the patrol calls the 100 deadliest days of summer. He urges anyone who sees what appears to be impaired driving to call the highway patrol or 911. And he says all motorcyclists need a special license called an endorsement. Your license to drive a car is not enough. DK Wright, live in the 7 Newsroom, working for you.